Welcome back, everybody. We found out some pretty big stuff last episode. I had so much fun as well. But Rhea, which was a uh, second explosion that nobody knew about, they had to put that one off because it had to cover up this other explosion that they were using to bury something or to cover something up. What were they covering up? Let's find out. Chapter 4. Flicker. Pike, it's all on this USB drive. All the evidence you need to nail Typhon for Gabe's death and plenty more. All right. Bring it with you. I'll meet you in an hour. Something's going to happen in this Talk USB soon. drive. Nothing works out this easy. Of Haven Springs. We are live at the Scream Festival. One final reminder to head over to the Lathe Flower Cart and grab a rose before they're gone. At Haven's inaugural Spring Festival, eligible women of good stock and birthing age would offer up roses in order to attract a mate. What can I say? History is weird. Thankfully, we've lost the mating stuff, but kept the roses. And if you do have a special someone in mind, a rose is a great way to say you care. And an even better way to say, hey look, a rose. Sounds fun. Is giving away a rose something I'd do? Maybe. I can decide downstairs. So I get to choose who I want to date by giving away a rose, I'm sure. For now, I'll grab the USB stick. That's a PlayStation controller right there, baby. That is what I'm talking about. Chinese takeout, laptop. Where's the USB stick at? Oh, I wasn't paying like that close attention. That looks like like it right there. Okay. Twelve okay. gig. Time to head downstairs. One hundred twenty-eight gig. Okay, let's. let's if we're going. We're gonna go pick up people here. That's. Hot dog shirt says I like wiener. Cat shirt says, I like pussy. Yeah, that probably says that too. So, <laughs> this is how we're deciding. We're picking either the wiener shirt or the pussy shirt. Since I am... Probably... You guys don't get to decide, I guess. Alright. I like pussy. Let's go. No offense to any ladies out there. Ooh, do I get? Oh, I've been playing more these past me. few weeks than the last few years. Feels nice. Gotta wear this bird hat. No. Test, test, check. <clears throat> Dude, hopefully we get to play guitar and sing or something. Check. Holy shit! You own a skirt? And a cat shirt. Don't forget about the cat shirt. Hey guys. Happy first spring fest. Thanks. I need to apologize to you guys. What happened in the apartment? Something really messed me up. These past few weeks, I thought I had a handle on my emotions. But after what happened with Charlotte, it's the same old story. I lose control and I hurt the people I care about. I'm they should sorry. understand. Yeah. Fuck that. If anyone needs to apologize, it's me. Ever since we've met, you've been there for me. And then when you're the one struggling, I bail. Not cool. I'm really sorry. If we're both sorry, does that just cancel everything out? I think so. We're back to normal. 
Not to spoil the moment, but Typhon blew up their own mine. Why? I don't know yet. But we have all the evidence we need to nail them for Gabe's death. I got a hold of Pike. He'll be here soon. Once he sees what's on that stick, it's over for Typhon. No, it's not. Hence the celebration. <laughs> I think we've all earned the right to enjoy ourselves a little tonight. Gotta find out what the they're covering on up. Soon. You'd better be front and center. Oh, Rad. Do you need help setting up for the show? Nah, it's all good. We're almost there. I have to run back to the trailer. Go be a normal person for a while. Can't make any promises. Text me when it's ready. If I wanted to give away a rose, Steph and Ryan would definitely be on my list. Anyway, time to enjoy the festival. Got a phone call or text. Typhon Mining says, Happy Spring Festival. Happy in Springs community. Thank you for letting us celebrate with you. Nobody gives a shit. Jelly. 232. 233. 234. Oh, this guy's crazy. No. Another year, the red another one was prize gift card for yours Wait. truly to keep. I'm such a little Damn devil. It. Really? Come on, <sighs> Jelly. Hi. Oh, hey. Nice to see you. You're taking this jelly bean thing very seriously. Yeah, because the prize is a $100 gift card. Oh, big money. My mom just got a promotion, so I thought I could take her out for a nice dinner. Which what is are really you, embarrassing, saying it out loud. Not at all. That's sweet. Maybe I can help. I want to see what she's got to say. Oh, for real? Are you good at this? How many jelly beans do you think there are? Um, can I read this chick's head? I'm gonna go with 800, yo. It's always more than you think it is. I'd say like 800 or so. Huh. Yeah, could be. Feels like something just changed in that lady by the jar. Maybe I should read her. 800's actually not bad. Hopefully they don't go lower. Oh, I was close? Maybe I should say something. Oh. Hey, I've got another guess. Yeah? 700. I think it's closer to 700. Yeah. 700 feels right. But we have to get it exactly. Just felt that lady's heart skip a beat. I should read her again. What does she care? Somebody's got to win. Jimmy, they're really close to 731. Who is this girl? Hell yes! Your secret's mine. Oops. Oh, we're setting this guy up. The answer is 731. Don't ask me how. 731 jelly beans. That's... That's correct. Yes! Thanks so much for your help. You rule. You're a welcome, <laughs> no jelly bean guy. Now let me grab a damn beer. I don't think this thing is checking IDs. Nobody tell Pike. Is she not? Oh, she's not 21, huh? She's like 18. She seems so much older, though. I've got some time to kill. Might as well wander around and be social. No. It happened oh, last let's year. Talk to Jed. Yep. I remembered clear as day. Probably it's been a hell of a month. PM. But this and he was already makes drunk it all as a scout. Jed loves this town so much. It's inspiring. I don't think Jed did it, or Jed has anything to do is with it. Different from the lantern. We all agree. But don't ever rule anything anyway, out. He comes Love racing out. station broadcast live from the park. Right? I see it him feel like a tiny Coachella. <laughs> oh, hi, Val. They even looped you into participating, huh? She's 
She's happy. This is awesome. Favorite time of the year, by far. That kind of enthusiasm is infectious, especially for me. Let's go hang out with these chicks. This is that whole communal gathering thing everyone's always going on about. Yep, I get it. I guess Riley is feeling sentimental tonight. I just wanted to take but a second to say... Around. Where is she? I just wanted to take a second to say how wonderful Haven really is. Nights like this always remind me how lucky I am to call this place home. No other place will ever come close. You're not so bad yourself. And the poor bastard is so drunk, he forgot he doesn't know how to swim. It's nice to see Jed so in his element. Took a minute. So then. Where's the after party this year? After party? Come on. Young man like yourself. God. You must know they just what hope the Riley is. is doing all right. Oh no. Honestly, I'm getting pretty bushed. What happened to Riley? They're calling it a night soon. My goodness. Hi, Eleanor. Good evening, dear. Hey, so where's Riley? I haven't seen her around. She's not really in the festive spirit. She was supposed to leave town tonight. If it wasn't for, you know. Oh, I'm sorry. You were so helpful to me that day at the shop. If you see Riley, maybe you could help her too. Sure, I'll try my best. Somebody's gotta take care of you, Eleanor. So, we doing shots tonight or what? Of course. Body shots. Ooh. Who's going first? Just kidding. <laughs> or am I? <laughs> <laughs> the decorations really turned out beautifully. It must have been a huge amount of work. It's worth it. I better get going. Oh, stuff. Wait. When is Ryan? Holy shit, Ryan! Steph and I want to hear everything. We're at the stage. Meet us when you're ready. Everything's set. Meet me. My dog is licking his. You know what right now, and I'm sure you can hear it. Come on, Sounds bro. Sounds like Ryan is ready for me. You too. Not during the videos. Can't wait to see this mystery band tonight. I'm the mystery band, baby. Wait, I thought this said meet him at the stage. I'm gonna ride this four wheeler. Did they say meet me at this stage? How stupid am I? Like, what's going on? Wait a second. Where was that, um... Was it Stefan or not? Wait to see this mystery band tonight. Oh, I see him. Diane. Hi, Alex. Wanted to wish you a wonderful spring, spring, first spring festival. Unfortunately, I have to work through it this year, but I really appreciate our conversation earlier today. It was great getting to know you better. 
Thanks, Diane. The pain is mutual. Harry is hiding. Hey. Oh, hey. I hope we're the mystery band. Just in time. <laughs> kind of a shitty thing so, to throw on someone, though. Who's playing? Yours truly. Seriously? That's awesome! Well, wait. Who else? You. <laughs> Who else is playing? She's like, oh shit. I hate you both. <laughs> we didn't want you to wuss out. <clears throat> I wouldn't wuss out. Who said anything about wussing out? Even though she would. Nobody, but only because we didn't give you the opportunity. This, this is going to be, be so awesome. sick. Trust me. Would it it have been nice to be able to like rehearse a little bit? You um, know? We've never played together before and... Uh, I'm nervous as hell. I'm shaking. Anyway... My mouth's dry. Sorry if this sucks. It's not gonna. Fuck it. Good words right there. Fuck it. Ooh, she's good, baby. looks like a freaking zombie. I wonder if we took like all her feelings away. I was kind of worried about that. I don't know. I just wanted to see what happened. Hey, Charlotte. How deep do you think? The lake, I mean. I don't know. I felt horrible this afternoon. I didn't know if I could survive that feeling. But now, it's like when your leg falls asleep. And even though it's still attached, it's become something other than you. Oh, yeah. She wanting to... My whole life, I've always felt so deeply. But now she doesn't feel at all. But maybe this is better? Charlotte, I'm so sorry. It doesn't sound good what? to me. I didn't mean for any of this to happen. Mm. Me neither.
She's kind of like an emotionless zombie. Good to see you, Alex. Have fun at the festival. Hey, come meet me on the rooftops. Oh. Hero, dude, thank you so much. You totally killed it. Award-winning bard material right there. Thanks. You were pretty amazing too, you know. Aw, shucks. Hey, come meet me on the rooftop. Sure thing. You know, about these text messages, it'd be nice if they started me, like, where I could start reading. I have to scroll up and figure out where I'm at. Notes to sell. Find the roses. Sounds like Steph wants to meet me on the rooftop. I wanted to find the roses. Okay. I gotta admit, this is a pretty great feeling. Yeah, that was pretty cool. I never found the roses. What are you so happy about? Been a while since I've seen you smile like that. She got an ice cream. It's like Kate, we are ice cream geniuses. Ice cream we run this shit. Keep flexing, ice cream lady. Click. As soon as we thought of it. My bad. What are you so happy about? They really like their ice cream. Bum 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 ba bum bum ba bum 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 uh, that beat's gonna be in my head for like the whole video. Should I clean these up? Oh, I can't. I feel like I should though. Go upstairs. Maybe she uh got the hint about the cat shirt. Hmm? Rare. That's what she did. Uh, you said you have some news? I'm leaving. I'm actually leaving no. Haven Springs. Can you believe it? Back on the road again. Fucking finally. Wait, seriously? I'm gonna play music again, Alex. Anywhere I want. God, I forgot how fucking good it feels. <sighs> Holy shit, Steph, that's so cool. I'm really happy for you. You better keep in touch. You think it's that easy to get rid of me? Come on, Chen. I need a new destination. <sighs> You're my good luck charm. You Are you have sure about shit that? taste in good luck charms. <laughs> Shut up. Holy crap, Berlin? That's Pick a long one. ways away. <sighs> Greetings from the middle of the ocean. Salem, Massachusetts. Ber they all suck. Um, let's go to the ocean. Wow, nice pick. All right, tell me about my life in the middle of the sea. cruise ship congratulations on your new gig playing drums in a cruise ship band I travel I all over work. I'll mix up the dad rock and show tunes with one bikini kill cover per <laughs> set nudge some yuppies toward better taste you could even throw in some originals before you know it you've got the world's first cruise core band That sounds like a pretty spectacular plan. Great. Then come with me. To the ocean? <laughs> sure, why not? Doesn't have to be our first stop, but one day. I still have friends in Seattle who book shows. Maybe we start there or, I don't know, Kansas City, Vegas, wherever we want. I like Haven though. I finally feel like I have a family. Look, I don't want to pressure you, but I've seen you give so much of yourself to make sure other people get what they need. And I guess I wonder if you've thought about what you need. I want my family. 
which is a haven. I mean, obviously, I like you a lot, Alex. You mean the fucking world to me. <gasps> Hug or kiss. What the heck? I wore the right shirt today. You don't have to decide anything now, okay? Just think about it. I will. Thank you. I'm gonna head back down. Just saying, you don't want to move back to later. Portland. <laughs> don't go back. Hey, Gabe. Can I tell you something? I think I solved it. Why you died. Who's responsible? Isn't that crazy? I'm out of threads to pull. Which is terrifying. Because on the other side of all this, after Typhon, after you, there's just... normal life. Kind of counting on you to show me how to do that. But I think I can figure it out. I just wish you were here to see it. Oh, um, also, Steph, so. Alex, do you have the USB drive? I do. Wait, I don't trust this guy there. all of a sudden. I don't trust Paul, him. Their secret plan, the cover up. You need to come with me to the station. Alex, don't make this hard.
he helps them cover up. He's bought and paid for by Typhon Mining. Probably isn't how you pictured your first spring festival, huh? Not exactly. Coffee? I'm drinking coffee right now, but I want to say, how about a beer? How about a beer? Worth a shot. Crew, stop doing that. Pike, why am I here? The long and short of it is, Diane is charging you with stealing her USB drive. Technically, it's her property. That's bullshit. I haven't done anything wrong. They're the criminals here. She just got a warrant for it. Did you steal this USB drive or not? At least tell me you looked at it. I can't. I'm sorry. You're conducting an investigation into Typhon, right? Everything you've been looking for is on that drive. It's got to get a warrant, though. Despite my best efforts, the case is closed. The order came down today. I did what I could, but, you know, the evidence just wasn't there. You're so full Sorry, of shit. Alex. I have the evidence. Right here. It doesn't matter. Look, what happened to my brother wasn't an accident. It was criminal. The files on that drive prove it. That could be true. But let's say it is. The issue is you stole Typhon's property. I can't work with that. I get it, but she doesn't get it. So I'm going to say it shouldn't matter. I just handed you a smoking gun. It shouldn't matter how I got it. Maybe not. But it does. Alex, you're not thinking about this clearly. Seems pretty clear to me. Diane wants to charge you with computer fraud. That's a federal crime, Alex. Five to ten, easy. You know what? Fuck Diane. This isn't justice. This is a joke. It's not that bad. Hey, I talked to her, and despite how angry she is at everything you did, she's willing to let it go. If you agree to drop everything, Typhon won't press any charges. Why would she do that? She just wants this whole thing to go away. This is how to make that happen. How much are you getting paid, buddy? Fuck that. I'm not signing anything. Alex. No. Typhon buried something in the mountains. Something so massive, they ignored Gabe's call and set off the blast just to cover it up. Don't you want to know what it is? What do you mean, cover it up? Another blast, unannounced, set off at the exact same time at the old mining site. And all of it happened just a few weeks before inspections were set to begin. Come on, Pike. It's all right here.
Like I said, it doesn't matter. Alex, please, just sign the form, and we can both go back to the party. No. Alex, this is not an offer that you can choose. I said no. No is not an option. Ooh, is he scared? What are you so scared of? See for yourself. Shit. What could be in that envelope? Typhon Mining Security, Threat Evaluation, Chen Alexandra. Brother, Gabriel Chen died in an accident related to Typhon Mining Blast. Hit read so we can read it better. Assessment. Intel shows subject has high level of determination and efficiency. Negative affection has persisted beyond predicted bereavement period. Suspect also appears to have possession of confidential data and information. Threat priority one, immediate action required. Uh, began following subject after meeting with Mac Loudon. Subject met with man identified as Ryan Lucan. Little else of note. Subject spent three hours in apartment. Wi-Fi screen monitoring revealed searching searches into Typhon's history and legal Ill litigation records. Subject met and spoke with client in the Black Lantern. It appears subject has stolen an object from client. Um, ass assisting Alexander Chen with her efforts against Typhon. Involved in an extremely distraught... Oh, this is Ryan Luke and I, sorry. Um, an extremely distraught over accident. Subject has high-level knowledge of both geography and residents of Haven. Threat priority one. Um, subject, Stephanie. Close friend, Gabriel, died in an accident related to Typhon Mining Blast. Assisting Alexander Chen in her efforts. Has proven resourceful and dangerous. Threat priority two. Is this a threat? What did you expect? Huh? The Typhon, a global organization with billions in revenue, an army of lawyers, and who knows how many politicians in their pockets would just what, throw up their hands and say, you got us. I thought I could get justice for Gabe. Yeah, well, Typhon has their own idea of justice. Shit. Believe me, I want nothing more than to make these fuckers pay. I've learned the hard way that it's not possible. They're too big. Too connected, too ruthless. You can hate me if you want. Call me a coward. But I don't want to lose you like we lost Gabe. Pike is terrified of Typhon. I bet if I took his fear away... But it's not just about me. Steph and Ryan are in danger too. Hmm. I don't like taking people's stuff away. I want to hurt Typhon so bad. But can I really put their lives at risk along with mine? Dude. That is rough. This is such a hard decision. Sign Typhon's affidavit. Risk taking Pike's fear. Well, in real life, I would probably give up. Oh, we're going for it, baby. Do you want to risk your life over this? Gabe, Mac, Alex, who's next? Fuck, fuck, fuck. Just keep your head down, Tony. You're just a shit heel. Typhon's major league. Typhon doesn't lose. Typhon disappears, people. Let them get killed. Not you. I know you're afraid. I am too. I know you think that Typhon is too big, too 
invincible. But they're not. I will bring them down. I just need your help. Have courage or forgive. Forgave. If not for me, then forgave. Please. Fuck. I'll think about it. Thank you. Get the hell out of here. Really? All right, I could. I did Alex. not call it. <laughs> Be careful. He was just scared. For very, very good reason. Alex, come see me when you get the chance, Jed. if they've been watching us and what will they do if <sighs> now she's got to deal with this crap I'm not giving up to Typhon though there's no way we're gonna die trying I have no idea what to do next. Maybe talking to Jed will help me feel better. First, I need to get out of this dress. Wish I could turn the music on. Shattered glass? Looks like I'm on my own oh. now. I don't want to drag Ryan and Stefan any deeper. Nah, dude, they're down. They know the risks. Might as well go talk to Jed now. Let's see what other clothes we got here. Oh, that's it. Hey, Jed. There she is. Have a seat. Something tells me you've had a more exciting spring festival than you planned for. You saw Pike arrest me. And let you go, apparently. Then there's that business with Ryan and Steph earlier today. I wasn't sure why it took all three of you to work out Diane's lunch order. Come on, Jed, don't be part of this shit. I know you're used to looking out for yourself. Gabe was like that. But Haven's a community. We help each other. I want to help you. But first, you have to let me know what's going on. Fuck it. What have I got to lose? I'm so nervous. Do we tell him you think he's bad and he's the guy that gets all this info? I'm so nervous. Typhon threatened Ryan. Typhon killed Gabe. I'll just say Typhon killed Gabe. 
Typhon killed Gabe. I have proof. What proof? I stole it from Diane. Emails and documents proving there was a second explosion the night Gabe died. To cover something up, Jed. Some secret they buried. I don't know what it is. I don't even know what to do next. But I'm not giving up. Not ever. I know what they're hiding. Please, Jed. What's the truth? What are they afraid of? Typhon's the devil that runs this town. I've been carrying their secrets for far too long. Thank I God. Know they buried in the mountains. <sighs> Tell me. I'll do one better. I'll show you. I'll show you. Shit. I have so many emotions right now. I'm thinking he's good now for sure. But then I was like, wait, what if he's going to kill us when he's out, when we're out there? <laughs> what if some crazy crap like that happens? I don't know. There, up ahead. Where are we? The middle of nowhere. About two clicks that way is the mining site where you search for Ethan. Five clicks that way is town. What is this thing? Ventilation shaft. They're scattered everywhere. Over the years, mines grow into mines, creating a labyrinth under Haven. What you're searching for is down below. Don't push us, Jed. Jed. Why are you sad? Don't push us, Jed. No! Are you kidding me? No. I'm sorry, kid. My heart is racing right now. Jed. What are you doing? I tried to talk you out of it. Scare you off. I was sure those pictures of Ryan and Steph would do the trick. But you were relentless. Won't leave damn well enough alone. You don't have to do this. I do. Twelve years ago, I made a mistake. The kind of thing that you... you can't undo. But Typhon made me a deal. A way to save my town. Give my boy a normal life. I never wanted Gabe to get hurt. Go to hell. just happened it's not over I repeat it is not over yet oh how did my sister guess that from the beginning she's insane no all right um yeah 
that happened. And I'm freaking the hell out. I don't know if we're dead or what. But that is the end of the episode, guys. That was crazy. Um, there's one more chapter left. I wouldn't imagine you're not excited for it as I am. So I'll see you on the next one.